Welcome back to my channel Technology in the Future. After months of fever pitch rumors, supply chain hiccups, and countless will-they-won't-they -they blog posts, Sony looks ready to drop its next hybrid juggernaut, the Sony A7V, set to reshape the mid-tier full-frame battleground. This mirrorless marvel is penciled in for a mid-2025 debut and, if the leaks are accurate, could become the go-to rig for travel vloggers indie filmmakers and pro studio shooters alike. Sensor talk, pixel peeping and fresh silicon Sony's Alpha Heritage already gave us a rock-solid 33MP Exmor R CMOS in the A7IV, but insiders now tease two divergent sensor paths. Familiar route. Keep the 33MP chip, pair it with the brawnier Bions XR engine for speedier buffer clears and cleaner high ISO output. Hype route. Leap to a brand new 42 MP backside illuminated stacked sensor. That bump means razor sharp stills, oversampled 4K, slashed rolling shutter, and night owl low light chops. Either way, expect headline grabbing specs 15 plus stops of dynamic range, dual native ISO for noise free moonlit portraits, and color. Science borrowed from the A1 flagship on video vibes, Cinedi and Sony's cinema team has clearly sprinkled fairy dust here. We're talking 4K 120 FPS uncropped, 10-bit 4.2.2 internal flavors, and s cinetone baked in for quick-turn client work. Rumblings of 8K 30 FPS exist, but Sony may favor longer, cooler record times over bragging rights. Either way, active cooling, vents and graphene-based thermal pads are rumored. Goodbye overheat anxiety. Design tweaks and creator comfort borrowing the deeper grip from the A9 III, the A7V should feel glued to your hand even with a 7200 GM bolted on. A 5.76 million dot OLED EVF and that luscious 4-axis flip-tilt LCD headline ergonomics, while magnesium alloy weather sealing keeps monsoon shoots on schedule. Despite beefier internals, leaked CADs suggest the body actually shaves a few. Grams off the A7 IV price and positioning word on the wire pegs launch MSRP between 2799 2999 USD, parking it nose to nose with Canon's EOS R63 and Nikon's Z63. Meanwhile, the A7 IV has already slipped to $1,198 online, tempting budget watchers or giving you a reason to flip yours ahead of resale value drop off. Upgrade dilemma? Should you wait? If you crave AI-enhanced subject recognition, buttery 4K 120 slow-mo, and a sensor that can crop in forever, the A7V screams, hold your horses. But if 4K 60 and 33 MP files already crush your workflow, snag that discounted A7 IV and funnel the savings into glass. Switching camps, Canon is gearing up to unleash the long-anticipated EOS R6 Mark III, the next evolution in its full-frame mirrorless saga. Leaks point to a July-September 2025 reveal, perfectly timed for late summer trade shows and holiday pre-order madness. New 24 MP Stacked Sensor, Speed Meets Sensitivity. The headline upgrade is a fresh 24 MP Stacked CMOS that outpaces the R52 sensor yet stops shy of the R1 speed demon. Stacked architecture means faster readout, minimal rolling shutter, and beefier dynamic range, the holy trinity for hybrid shooters toggling between 20 FPS wildlife bursts and cinematic gimbal moves. Processing muscle and autofocus, IQ you under the A hood, a dual Digic X Plus. Digic Accelerator Combo delivers zippier menus, snappier buffer clears, and next-gen dual-pixel CMOS AF2 with deep learning subject detection. Expect IAF that locks on from half a soccer field away and sticks like glue even at f1.2, Canon is clearly done playing second fiddle. Internal 6K RAW up to 60 FPS, edit flex to punch in, reframe, or pull stills. KI 120 FPS without the nasty. Crop, ideal for buttery slow-mo b-roll dot Canon log 2 and log 3 profiles on board, opening wide dynamic range playgrounds in DaVinci Resolve. Active cooling vents similar to the R5C prototype, plus oversampled 4K pipelines, suggest the overheating memes of yesteryear are finally dead. Body ergonomics and LCD love photogs itching. For flexible framing, we'll dig the revamped Flippy Tilty 3.2-inch LCD, perfect for low-angle macro or arm's-length vlogging. 
Weather sealing, dual UHS-2 SD plus CFX press type B slots, and a slightly meatier grip round out the chassis tweaks. Pricing chess match with the R62 now permanently at 2,109.99 and sub 2K refurb. Insiders peg the R63 launch tag around 2,499.2,199. That positions it neatly between Sony's A7 IV sale price and the rumored A7 V sticker, ensuring Canon loyalists get upgraded horsepower without hemorrhaging savings. Who should upgrade if? You're sitting on the original R6 or a 5D Mark IV and crave 6K RAW, superior low-light noise control, and high-speed AF for sports. The R63 is a no-brainer. R62 owners who rarely push past 4K 60 or 20 FPS bursts might be better served investing in an RF 7200, F2.8, or RF 35 F1.2 instead. SEO ready keyword sprinkle, mirrorless upgrade guide, full frame camera showdown, stacked sensor benefits, 4K 120, slow motion, YouTube creator gear, hybrid photo video rig, best camera 2025, Sony versus Canon mirrorless, dynamic range tips, autofocus AI, low light performance, content creator essentials, RF lens roadmap, E mount glass, camera overheating fix, vlog camera comparison. Final Take 2025 is shaping up as a blockbuster year for content creators. Sony's A7V looks set to redefine do-everything reliability with bleeding-edge resolution and frame rates, while Canon's R63 bets big on stacked sensor speed and raw flexibility at a wallet-friendlier entry point. Whichever camp you pledge allegiance to, both bodies promise future-proof specs for YouTube, TikTok, Netflix doc production, or that once-in-a-lifetime wedding gig. Hit that like button, punch subscribe, and ring the bell so you never miss our deep dive reviews, lens tests, and creator workflow hacks. Drop your upgrade dilemmas in the comments. Are you Team Sony or Team Canon for 2025? Catch you in the next upload.